Wow, that was impressive and nasty. I'm gonna run away. Bye. Oh yeah, it's another one. Woo! I was supposed to be on the tall neck. I'm being killed by a bird. I was not paying attention. Why did I get thrown off the tall neck? I very much... Wee! Stop to my game. On the tall neck. Fox, help me. Help me! Where are you, bird? Oh, you were right there. I don't like you already. Woo. Ah. Please, arm, um, stop it. I need you to focus. Oh no. Uh. Already? Okay, well now, <laughs> now I know I don't start on the tall neck. Game. Choose a different weapon. Nope, that one. Now where'd you go? I'll take your wings off. Oh, that was nasty. You got them. Spiky thingies! Uh. There you go. Uh. Alright, come here. Uh. Not quite like that. Land, you bastard! Ah! Oh, no, 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 not on me. All right, you're gonna get it now. Chicken. Evening, hi. Oh, for God's sake, my stream category. Uh, people will be disappointed if they're looking for fox and they, well, looking for a specific fox and they find me. Wait, let's pause it first. Cause I died. Uh, tools, docs, stream information. I always forget. I always forget. Oh, hi, Dr. Tims. Yee. Uh, it's not tunic, I'm afraid. <laughs> I forgot to change it. Uh, well, I have played tunic, and I will play tunic. Not today. What's bippin', baby bippins? <laughs> I'm bippin'. Oh, uh, yeah. I fixed it now. Um... I hope that's refreshed it. I had a rude awakening from this game. I thought I would start on top of the tall neck, and I did not. I spawned getting attacked by a bird. So that's how this stream has gone so far. It's been eventful, and uh, I'm all a bit of a mess. <gasps> White rise! Very nice. One of the draft towers, yeah. This big disc headed thing. They're very cool. Whoops. Now where am I going? That way. Is that my next quest? It is my next quest. Okay, let's go there. I have <laughs> yes, I have Ubisofted. I have uh <laughs> I have assimilated it. Oh, congratulations on your Elden Ring run. Five more. Goodness, that sounds like I'm going the wrong way. 
sounds like an absolute slog. I do not envy you, because I don't think I could do Elden Ring. You've seen how well I do on this. Elden Ring is not going to be my forte. Ooh. It's a blast. <laughs> I have a feeling it would be... Uh, I would be blasted to play it. Nothing like having a good stream up. <laughs> yeah. Omelettes are great. I actually, I want to try and make one this week. Horizon is pretty difficult. But uh, I, it's difficult in a I can do this kind of way, as opposed to difficult in a this game wants to kill me kind of way. Like, Elden Ring, I feel like the game itself wants you to die. And Horizon, it's almost like, this is a dangerous world, but you can survive it if you want. Damn it. Oh, I always love mac and cheese recipes. Yes, please, because at the moment I just make, make box mac and cheese. Oh, you again. I don't like you. Oh, you're attacking someone. Stop it. Leave them alone. Yes, please DM me. Thank you. This bandit. I've seen enough people playing Elden Ring to know that I do not want to play Elden Ring. I I find games that are uh, I find games that are designed to be hard uh, too much for my my uh, poor little constitution. I want to play a game to have fun. I do not want to play a game to die. Although dying can sometimes be absolutely hilarious. It's easy to cheese. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't. I was not looking. Everyone all right? You saved our lives. Okay. Well, I may do that then if I if I ever get it. I have. Whoa, I have way way too many games to play right now to have another 40-hour playthrough game <laughs> to add to it all. The red light you see around you has withered most of our crops. What little we carry, we had to collect. My tea ready? Ow. Nope. So this well, that answers that question. It is. Our home plane song lies just down the road. I'm afraid you won't see many outlets oh, like yourself. Oh, I there. see. Wow. So it's both co op and competitive. That seems mean. I, I prefer competitive. I no, I don't. I, com I prefer cooperative games. Um, I like that aspect, but I don't want to be griefed. Excuse me. <clears throat> I think I would probably only play GTA serv GTA games on private servers, but I don't. I'm not even particularly interested in the subject matter. I think if I'm not, I don't know. I'm just not particularly invested. There's enough I have problems with in the real world to have a fictional version of the real world to be causing problems. <laughs> so what? Are you are you overseas now, or is is there a pangolin that? was like a rescue from a, a zoo or a sanctuary or a smuggling. Oh wow, goodness. Half coyote, oof, that's tough. You really need someone with uh, patience, stamina, and a lot of knowledge and experience to know what they're doing to look after a half coyote. I used to um, I used to volunteer at an animal sanctuary in the village I used to live in in England when I was younger, and they had a fox cub, and he was very sweet, and I got to hold him when he was young. But the the older he got, the more he the more wild he got, and there was there's some animals that just don't they don't acclimatize well because they're wild. Um, but I think some people, especially now, where you have things like TikTok, where you have people misrepresenting what it means to have these kind of animals that people get ideas in their head about what animals should be like and they're not I have no idea why I'm going up here Sting. Wonder how long these gusts can keep it up 
intolerance to pain, I guess, is good when you have to deal with not being bitten by wild animals. Hello. Ooh. Come on. This doesn't really help me, but that was fun. Big squid. Do I know? Uh, yes, actually, I just retweeted one earlier today that was doing really, really reasonable ref sheet commissions. I was very surprised. Oh no, I've been seen! I don't know where from. Uh, I can't remember who it is, but uh, check down my feed. I, I know I retweet a lot, but there was definitely one today that I shared. Um, and I was like, oh, I may actually consider getting a new ref sheet for ARC seeing as all my art has been of a specific type lately. I may actually need to get a ref sheet to reflect that. Unidentified signal. Oh, Discord, yes, Discord, yes, yes, get the sheets! Where am I being seen from? There's a narc out here. Supporting me to all their machiney friends. Sparkle! Hello! Good afternoon. There will be a bit of a delay. It looks like the coordinate silence gave me matched that wreckage. Oh no. Did he install Hades on another Titan? <laughs> Fox and Reno, who are singing my song with those two. Oh, I don't want to go down there. Thank you, Flo. I need to post um, the gift I gave you on Twitter, actually, because I haven't... Uh, I never actually posted that in full. It's a lot to explore down there. I wonder what I could find. I would like to explore more, but I am terrified of the deep, and I will drown myself probably. It's happened before. Yeah, botch, 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 botch. This is very, very pretty. Uh, this kind of post-apocalyptic overgrowth aesthetic is something I really like. It's one of the reasons I want to play the Kirby game. Ah! High time. This is it. The location of the <laughs> coordinates I scanned from the spire. Did I just say it's one of the many reasons I want to play the new Kirby game? I think I thought it, and then the pie fell on my head, and I got distracted. Shop underneath a dead Horus Titan. I don't remember if I actually said it or not. Place silence could slink away to. But what was he doing here? That device is. I did. Thing. I did say it, so I've said it twice now. Uh, oh. Whoopsie Daisy. This is. I love ADHD. It's fantastic. Anyway, consider this message a beacon to help guide you out of the fog of ignorance. Orb. <gasps> We're pondering an orb. Hmm. We shall ponder it. Ponder. First, we must find the orb, then we can ponder it in person. Ooh, play. So cramped in there, no room to think. You can't even speak. Now, the processing orb of a Titan, on the other hand, well, you're used to that. But once I load you on that, you'll be so much more comfortable. Excuse me. Oh no. T. Is it game another? Hey Matt, welcome. Yeah, oh, I don't, I don't want to be the death of your phone. <laughs> but I'm happy that you're here. Good to see you. 
upgraded three weapons. This one I have not used yet. Sky Drifter Circuit. Oh, I have quite a few of those. Good. Ooh. Ah. Have I ever actually equipped this yet? I'm just going to be thrown at full draw. I don't have that equipped. Oh! Fuck. Scary. Inventory. Weapons. Champion Spear. That's the. Where is it? Prototype. That's the one I must have upgraded, I think. Ah! Oh, I had all this stuff I could have used and I didn't know. Strong arm hunter bow. That is what is. What? I wasn't using that? That's got a higher critical hit chance. Oh, it's only got. Oh. I see. I do slight. I do quite a bit more damage with this one right now. Okay. Alright. I am learning things. 12 hours into the game. <laughs> oh no, what are you going to do to me? I have started making the Twitch Clips compilation, by the way. And uh, there's a whole section on uh, uh, Tifa interactions and chat things. What trail? This trail? It's big. Did you run two? Yeah. It's fun though. I actually, I realized uh, quite sadly I had forgotten that I'd uh, deleted all my alien isolation footage because I didn't have a hard drive at the time. So um, I had to go back and download a couple of videos to, uh, to get a couple of the things that I know people would have clipped if I had not, uh, if I'd had it at the time. Hello, friend. Goodbye, friend. Oh, scavengers. <laughs> more pie. Maybe I should sit more front on so the pie hits me in the face again. Alien Isolation is one of my favorite run-throughs I've ever done in a game. And being in a fursuit, <laughs> I could see nothing. And it helped a lot with the suspense of everything. Watching it through again and hearing how many noises I made. Oh, oh yeah, there's a whole, like... Uh, the Super Lucky's Tale as well, when I went through that, um, I realized I had a whole uh, five minute section from one video of just fox noises and swearing. <laughs> so. The AI was terrifying. It's down there. <laughs> oh, is that? Yes, uh, I guess they are. Well, for me, <clears throat> I have very specifically, uh, very specific swearing moments, and also, um... Oh! Oh, you! You, you, you! I have, I have both. Um, I have foxy swearing, and I also have, uh... Noises. Ow. Well. Damn birds. Do not like to bird. Waste it. <laughs> I'm trying to swear a little bit less, but sometimes there will be some compound uh, swearing that will come out. Oh, I'm back here. You gonna give me anything else fun to look at? Oh, climbing. 
Do I need to get up there? No, it wants me to follow the orb. Moment. <laughs> it's a me moment. Okay, the meanest sounding fuck. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I don't get mean, I get very annoyed though. But, like, I've got to mean it like, fuck! Hang on. I've got to get the face for it. Whoa! Wrong one. Uh, where are we? <gasps> fuck! How's that? <laughs> I also have red eye rage as well. Fuck! Like a demonic fuck. My, <laughs> my eyes are... Woo! That's a uh, that's an emote that Cade uh, Cade did a lot of uh, secondary expressions for me. Um, uh, his twitter.com slash Cade art, and he uh, basically whenever you do your request expressions, but he'll also do some of his special ones like uh, like this, and then this. So, oh well. I see you. Take me to your leader. Anyway, um, <laughs> yeah, he gives you those free um, so that he can be. Uh, so you can just have silly emotes like that. Oh, yeah, I haven't done dad mode yet. I need to do that dad mode. <laughs> so. Uh, I got the wrong freaking thing on. Oh, wow, you went all the way down. That's it. Oh, I did it! Yay! Oh, a scare actor? Oh, that sounds fun. That sounds cool. I've done uh, I've done some mascot work. I haven't done scare work like that though. Need more. Ow, pee! <laughs> 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 ah! <laughs> gotcha. God, stop it. I don't like you. Mean puppy play. We do not like this. Are you a puppy? I'm gonna shaft you anyway. Uh, all my stuff is gone. <laughs> Listen. Oh uh, dear, I forgot I was crouched. That's why I wasn't running anywhere. Ark doing combat squats here. Where are you? Where'd you go? You did not get all the way over there. Come here. Ugh. I have done crouched archery shooting um, when I was doing my historical reenactment combat. Um, I uh, we had to do all kinds of different uh, shooty displays. I was on the archery line, and I've done some very uh, the the speed shooting was one of the most fun things to do. Because English archers uh, at places like Agincourt could shoot, uh, on average, about 15 arrows a minute. And uh, I, ju I think I managed to hit 14. And that was fun. <sighs> uh. 
it's also actually having doing this clip compilation is cool because it means I can I can uh, truncate it to do a channel trailer, which is what I've been meaning to do for months. So I'm actually really looking forward to it. Uh, oh, archery is one of my all-time favorite pastimes. I I don't typically do sports sports, but archery is will always be one of my favorite things. Oh. Let me get the weed. Let me get the water weed. Water weed. Where am I going? Rushing me. Rushing me. Oh, wrong one. Yeah, I got it. Did I get it? I must have gotten both. All right. I mean, I'm playing in the water now. Time to go. I need more tea. Nom nom nom. <laughs> I remember that. I uh, I quite often like scaring people. Um, so, because I sometimes have a a little a little naughty streak like that. Verb. What on earth did he get that out of there? Mmm. Guest wants you to follow the trail. Archers. Yeah. Didn't expect to see anyone else out here. Woo! Uh, it might be handy to reset. Yeah, you can be angry with me. I don't mind. Well, I mean, I'd prefer it if you weren't. But... Oh, there! Oh, hello. Nora doing this far west? I was talking to myself, thank uh, you very much. No matter, no matter. I can get you stocked up for the wilds if you need. I presume she was talking to the machine and not the, the merchant. Whoa, Aloy, goodness. I mean, we parkour, but that's too that's too much. Oh, what are these? Wow, I have a lot of things. I have not been paying attention to anything. Have fun with that. Thanks. I did equip it, cool. I know, they're so pretty. I would eat so many gems if it would transform me into something like a pangolin fox. Wouldn't he have to be a full one? I'll take a half one. Back to the trail. Pangolin fox dragon, that would be fun. Oh, it's one of them! Is it a kangaroo? Is how interesting. Where are you? Where are you? Uh, weak lash. Weak versus something. Strong versus electricity. Sorry, Rue. You probably have bits that I need. Woohoo! Woohoo! Jeez. Oh, you were uh, not kidding. And you know where I am. Wow, that was impressive and nasty. I'm gonna run away. Bye! Ooh, yeah, it's another one! Woohoo! Ah, bugger. You're nasty. <laughs> Jeez. This is nasty jump rope. Whoa. Okay, one done. Help. I do. I would rather pet the kangaroo than shoot the kangaroo, but it has bits that I need. Yes, they were satanic panicking over forks. This was back in the Renaissance era. No, pre-Renaissance. I think that was like... I can't remember when it was. Um, but yeah, it was ridiculous. It was very twirly kangaroo. It gets 
Kiki's. Oh. There was a second one, right? They have weird spawning and sort of despawning things going on here. You're bouncing. You're bouncing. <laughs> no, no, God intended you to burn your fingers, get messy, and uh, encourage you to lick your fingers and get infections from all the stuff you hidden underneath your fingernails throughout the day. I swear, these are probably the same kind of people that are like, you need a man wipe to wipe your men fingers. Ooh. Ooh. I'm sneaking. You can't find me. Metal bite. What utensils did Romans have? I don't know. I think they just mostly used knives, and that sometimes they had. When I did medieval reenactment, we have a we had a um, a metal prong. It was just like a single pronged prong, a spoon, uh, as well. Where's the trail gone? Yeah. Well, I mean, D&D has a problem with uh, too many forks, generally, but that's usually a bard's problem. <laughs> Leaves were made, not made for wiping a bum hole. No, you use your fingers just like God intended. <laughs> no, no toilet paper. Fingers only. Fingers for everything. Communal brush. Use your servant's fingers. Use your hand. God. Why does it always go down to this? Uh, you turn my chat into a house of filth. Hawks, okay. yeah. It's because I'm British, mate. For the silencers that machine to haul his prize. Communal bush. Oh, goals. Oops, did I say that out loud? Uh, um, that must be the orb Sion stuck Hades in. Where am I? Looks like a thermal facility. Oh, zero dollars. Processor. Fazbor. Is that a Five Nights at Freddy's reference? Da da. Thou art sinner for just to wipe our ass with a bush. Oh. No. Gene locked hatch. Take a look around first. I looked at it. He wouldn't let me. Oh, examine Hades. Probably not. It's a little desolate. Burning bush. <laughs> Thou shalt not conduct us cleanery with the greenery. <laughs> These people are ridiculous. Hades? Oh, a squiggly. Is that you? Hello, squiggly. You don't look so good. Oh, small squiggly. This, I think something's going to happen. Silence asked you where to find a backup of Gaia. Oh, that's a squiggly noises. Uh, uh, yes, Hades was uh, the s sort of uh, AI that Silence uh, found and installed in the big monster at the end of the first game, I think. It's like you've been 
don't remember the recap. And what did you tell him? Boop, 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 boop. Don't remember any of it? What, like Do we you at this fire? Anything is anything is a sin if it is done by someone who the church wants to take out at the time. Okay. So Peter's a rabbit. You broke him. These are too pretty to destroy, and Silence was like, no. Do you know where Silence went? Yeah, that's the one Family Guy joke I thought was funny, was uh, Peter Griffin was looking for a book on potty training, and uh, he went to the library and he was given a couple of suggestions, like everybody poops and things like that, and he says, well, we're raised Catholic, and I said, oh, you want this one then, and the book title was something like, you're an evil child and that's pure evil coming out of you. Do you know and that was very, I thought that was very apt. Ruins? That's probably the only Family Guy joke that I ever actually uh, took with me as like, yes, that was funny. Obviously. Other why? than the, the uh, this place? passport skin color grading one. But religion... Religion kind of, a lot of religions survive on the idea of sin, don't you? They want you to become dependent on the idea that salvation is only through the people who run the church. It's a, it's a, it's a massive Ponzi scheme, really, isn't it? Because it, it sells you, it's selling you blackmail, basically, selling you emotional blackmail. And the Mormons even tell you this. They say that, basically, when they come into your door and convert you, you say, now you've heard the word of God, you're a sinner. So, if you had not heard the word at all... If you ask them about it and they say, well, if you hadn't heard the word of God, you'd be pure. And then, you know, and, and basically Mormons, by telling people that they are sinners, make them sinners in order to make them Mormons so they can contribute to the church. When the mysterious signal transformed you, it made Gaia's other subordinate functions conscious, too. It's such a racket. I hate Gaia it. destroyed herself, but so did they. Where did they go? Especially when uh, churches are non-profit, so you can basically gather a congregation, tell them to contribute any amount of money, and then just use it for a minimal amount of church upkeep and get a house and a car and everything out of it. It's, it's just a flatbed for widespread embezzlement and corruption. Well, I mean organized religion in terms as opposed to faith. So, like, organized Western religion, Christianity, is that kind of, you know, it can veer itself towards that sent that kind of institutionalized uh, indoctrination uh, when churches I mean but also but I mean historically as well you look at the Catholic churches you look at churches of England and how badly they've hidden abuses and rewritten histories and omitted things um, I mean the Catholic Church is massively massively damaging there were 12 disciples so each of them wrote a book and so did Mary Magdalene signal. and what you only get the four because that's what serves the purpose the first line of what is it the book of doubting thomas said something like uh it's basically going on about how you didn't need a church to worship god and obviously that's bad for churches it's bad for pastors because if they don't have a place where they can keep people then the church isn't needed anymore and people can find faith and they can find god and live in god's image completely without quote unquote guidance and then there is no need for this kind of oh false prophet kind of money laundering church institution. Enough. I'm not anti-faith, but I am anti-organized religion. Yeah, polytheism, uh, humanitarianism, stuff like that I find much more reasonable. I mean, if I am anything, I am kind of Quaker Buddhist. I like the Quaker state of mind where it's like, actually, uh, one of the tenets of it is that the book is a, written by man and that it is fallible. Sorry for anyone who's trying to follow the plot, by the way. Like me. Uh, so, that, that, you, that you can gain great guidance from the Bible, but, but it is a book, essentially, written by man. 
parable, a set of parables, and that you can find God through its teachings. Polytheistic is uh, multiple gods, like Norse, like paganism. Um, the Romans were polytheistic. And obviously in Japan has multiple deities in Shinto. Uh, it's what you were designed to do. As opposed to monotheism, which is like Christianity, which is one god, and atheism, where there is no god. There won't need to be. I'm saving this one. You go for it, Eloy. He's going. Yes, Celtic religions, Assyrian. No, you're fine. You don't have to apologize for ignorance. It's not your fault for not knowing something. It's not like you're using that ignorance to, you know, punch down on anyone. Ignorance is only, uh, only has to be apologized for when it's used to hurt. We are all begin in a state of ignorance. I see you've dealt with hate. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Hey, you just giving everything away. Stay dead this time? And I was not listening. You can trust. Trust? Yes. Trust. As in, since I did what you could never do. Extracted all of Hades' priceless knowledge. There, is, there are good Christians. I know there are good Christians. But a lot of people who tell you that they're Christians are often not the kind of good Christians. holograms instead of face-to-face? What, afraid I'd stab you or something? There's a reason I... I'm using the same spyware. I see, so... All those times I called, you could have just answered. But I guess you just prefer to go on spying all this time. My world <laughs> stopped revolving around you months ago, Aloy. I have had work to do. Oh, look at those trousers. Countless hours of research. Look at all her stuff. Look at just her generally. I'm just oh, so enamored. <laughs> right. Of course. Wants to be Aloy. That's right. The difference, of course, is that unlike you. I've produced results. No, no, no. Bitch. Did you find a backup of Gaia or not? Oh, yes. I believe I did. Where? Yeah, I think it... Voila. Yeah, there are so many... Why do you think I summoned you here? ...bad people who use... Behind that jewel-locked hatch... ...what should essentially be a good foundation to do bad things. Christianity is one of those. You look at the tenets of Jesus. Look what Jesus did himself. All those things. And now people are like, oh, homeless people are, you know, disgusting and, uh, you know, not giving any, not giving out Medicaid, Medicare. Well, the 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 predominantly Christian wing of politics is the absolutely least Christian part of American politics. Just to. Hades said that there are backups of Gaia in there. Yes. Or were, anyway. Thousands of years ago. Backups that didn't get purged when Ted Farrell wiped every copy of Apollo. Correct. According to Hades, this facility could not be accessed by remote signal. Not even Ted Farrell could touch the data here. Backups. Data complete. Gaia and her subordinate functions. Bum, bum, bum. Everything needed to reboot the system. Oh, I have to look that up now. I can't do it. Yet. Over the XKCD ten fifty three. In there. So Hades said. So what are you waiting for? I don't trust you, silence. Did Hades reveal the source of the mysterious signal? The one that woke it, tried to destroy life on Earth. Yes, it did. Oh yeah, go for it. That'd be nice. Thank sure. you. Or Discord is fine. Time. Now that I actually remember to use it at least once a day. Last I checked, you still had a super intelligent AI named Gaia to reboot. Yeah, the same Gaia who had to destroy herself 20 years ago because of the signal. It may not be a good idea to reboot it until that signal has been no longer taken threat. care of. What if it repeats? It won't. Even if it did, well... Look, the details are complicated, but the Got my tail. You Hades can see it swishing behind me. Crazy arm. And Ooh, safe. Thank you. Now stop wasting time. Go get a backup. Mean. You don't control me. You mentioned you've been busy. 
exceptionally busy. But not so busy you couldn't teach Tanakh the rebels to override machines, ride them as mounts. Mm -hmm. Aloy, the only issue you should be concerned about is obtaining a guy backup. Mm. Perhaps if you focused more, you might actually see results. That's not exactly a denial, oh. Sans. Oh. Take it any way you yes. Want. What will the outfit be? Mm. All right. I'll search the facility for a guy backup. Are you? Do you think you're gonna go uh, cyberpunky, or you think you're gonna go a little bit more like normal, like mercenary off duty kind of thing? Brainy could wear absolutely anything. Honestly, I think. Again, silence, and our next conversation will be face to face. But you won't have much to say on account of my spear being buried in your throat. Aloy, thanks to me, everything More after you desired, Okay, that's fair. Everything you've been fumbling about, like tank to top and cargo pants, I guess. Within your grasp. Uh, or tech wear, tech wear, tech wear, tech wear. Much about manners growing up in the <laughs> but in a situation like this, you say thank you, and I say you're welcome. Bleh. Sad. Where's my angry? Greetings! Hey, Matt the Leopard, thank you! Welcome. Welcome to the show. We just finished a cutscene. No. I I really I really don't think you know uh the Rainer that we're talking about. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do?